Hello. I'm going to tell you about um, using MySQL to create databases uh, with graphical user interface. In this short video, I'm going to show you how to create databases, how to create um, tables inside it, how to insert values, how to display values from tables, and how to edit values in tables. So the first thing that you have to check is um, to check if this um, easy PHP is running on your computer. So you have to install it and you have to make sure that it is working. Uh, when it is working, um, the red button you see blinking uh, will be displayed in the notification area. So we open the browser, then we provide the request of localhost mysql so this is um, the home screen of my sql server let's say we open the database called um, uh, college it has got a table called students uh, we show the rows of students table they are follows displayed in students table so let's um, create uh, a new database from scratch let's say we create a database called kinder uh, as you see the database kinder has been created so we create also a new table let's say um, the new table is called parents it has got four columns the first one is um, father name the next is mother name then kid names and the bear key the edge. Let's say it is a character um, of 44. The mother name has got 45 maximum characters. Uh, the key the names has got um, 49. The key the edge, the type is maybe tiny integer. So I save, as you see, um, the table called parents has been created. So insert some values inside it. Let's say the father is Albert. The mother is And maybe the kid is edge here is maybe two. So I click on go uh, to save. As you see, there is um, a button called browse, which is now active. So I click on it to see what is inside parents table so what we inserted uh, is already inside the table so we add a new row again you add father name uh, like this edge here is maybe um, 12 then I click on go As you see, the second kit is also inside the table. So when we try to refresh and we again open kit database, we will see that um, the table parents is inside the. So when we click on properties, 
we will see the structure of this table if you want to change um, any column name uh, with uh, another name if you wanted to delete any column we just delete it from here let's say here uh, we, ch uh, we change the column then instead of being kid we call it names like this if we near the collector we increase them we make it 55 then save you will see that um, the column name has been changed and even the number of characters have changed so So let's say we want to add a new column here in this table. So we move down from this uh, view. We locate, uh, add a new field, add, new, add a new column. Let's say we add one column and maybe we want it to be located after mother name, after mother name. So here we choose where it is to be located. So we click on mother name then we click on go the column name here is to be maybe school um, the type um, is character let's say it has got 44 then you click on save immediately you will see that um, the column we added um, is now appearing after mother name so So when we click on a blouse, you see that um, we now um, have the column score. So if you want to enter something inside the score, we simply click on edit. If you want to delete any row, we click on delete. So we click on maybe um, edit. Here the score, maybe we call it Chigari parents. then go so as you see Kigari parents now is um, the school for the kid called Lana Isheja so this is it thank you for watching bye